And developing tonight, the mother of a boy who was shot and killed in Fordham last year still seeking justice tonight. One of the accused killers in front of a judge earlier today. News 12's Julio Avila was there. He spoke with the victim's mother. Julio, what happened? Well, the mother of that victim, Saiku Koma, she, he was, uh, she was inside the Bronx Hall of Justice earlier today where she saw the person accused of killing her son back in October. Now, unfortunately, we were not able to bring our cameras inside, uh, but we did hear, uh, and, and the hearing did end just as soon as we arrived. At the defense table was Samson Walston, one of those accused killers in an orange jumpsuit. Now, today's result, though, the judge moving the hearing to June 10th, and as the DA's office tells us it's because she did not agree with how uh, law enforcement presented their case involving testimony from police. Now, Walston was then uh, escorted out of the courtroom and Seiku's mother also walking out of the courtroom soon after with tears. Now, we spoke to her outside and she says that she feels that justice is not being served. It's like my son's life is not value to the judge or the lawmaker because I think they have to value the dead life. Because the people who kill him, they're free out there working. Now, last week, the first accused killer, uh, Stephen Mendez, he was released also on that same technicality, but we're being told that Walston will be held. Now, within the next 45 days, the prosecution has to try to represent their case once again, and that being on June 10th. We're in Concourse Village. I'm Julio Vila, News 12. All right, Julio, we'll continue to keep everyone updated on that. Thank you.